righteous protection. All right, y'all. Up next, we got a first time in a long time move set. But first, if you have not subscribed to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. Click that bell to enable notifications. Drop a like on the video. Leave a comment. Get in the conversation. The human suplex machine. Blah. The human suplex machine. There it is. <laughs> Hadn't done Taz since, what, 13? Been a long time. So, listen, man. <clears throat> Taz is one of them dudes that I just, I don't think he gets the respect he deserves. That dude is, man, I mean, y'all know I'm a suplex guy anyway. You know, I read, I, I just like suplexes. I, I appreciate the technique. And you watch Taz, he is so crisp and so incredibly clean. What is application that it and, and we ain't gonna get into the variations. Just know that I tried my best to get almost every variation in here, and I did. I got everything in here comfortably, with the exception of the head and arm, which we don't have. I wish we had. I wish we had the head and arm. I wish we had the gargoyle plex. Like yeah. There's just quite a few moves I would love to have, but we don't, so do what we got to do. I wish we still had the freaking Taz missions in here, like the the standard, the standing, and the uh, ground initiated, which that's what I tried to cover in the finishers with Cobra Clutch, and of course, Coquina Clutch being... The one he used most often. You remember he used to use the one where he sat down on their back. Would it applied? But other than that, man, Taz is, yeah, absolutely a technical masterpiece with him. And I mean, was, was Taz plexing everybody. And he ain't the biggest guy in the world. So that, that that's core and that's just pure strength. And doing the move correctly. Using leverage to your advantage. So, yeah, man. Taz is definitely that dude. Go watch some more of his matches. You know what it is. Keep it real. Live righteous.